Boom, what's up guys? Welcome to another episode of Yujui Brothers Savage Adventure Series. We've got a really awesome one for you today. We are here at, what? Yeah. I'm being groomed <laughs> Sorry. on camera. You had a piece of uh, stuff on you. I don't even know what it was. I, I didn't know if it was a bug at first. <laughs> oh. uh, we're in the middle of freaking nowhere. Came up here like two, two and a half hours driving. Man, but it's worth it because this place is really awesome. We are here at the deep river at Carbonton Dam. Really cool historic site, abandoned dam complex. It's really, really neat. Plus there's some other stuff that's uh, not far from here. We may add it to this video too. It's really freaking cool. So excited yeah. to do this. There's so much to just see and do. Yeah, it's gonna be awesome. We are, uh, we are, we are playing with time a little bit because uh, there's all kinds of rain clouds so the rain is just periodically running through so we're trying to get stuff done in between it all so oh it's gonna be awesome but you're coming along we're gonna go savage you going savage yeah savage. we're going savage let's do it peace guys stood 17 feet high and 270 feet long built in 1921 first electrical power plant in this in the sand hills and I guess there was an Evans Lock and Dam, probably similar to one, maybe similar to the one like we uh, saw at the Riverwalk. This is cool. Apparently, somebody made the claim that the United States is wasting money on dams. But look, it's got pictures of like construction. What it all used to look like and stuff and this is the house i was telling you about it's mm. supposed to not be far from here there's a, a site of a skirmish that actually um the influence is an inspiration Up for this stream to your left at the end of long horseshoe turn yeah so maybe it's there it's supposed to be there i don't know sits a historic antebellum plantation house that's pretty cool right the house still bears the scars of a skirmish so yeah, it must still be there. And it in, in, inspired the Patriot. Uh, yeah. That's so cool. Yeah, that's really cool. 1772 that was built. Wow. So we're going to go ahead and take out, uh, take a look at this dam, but it's right over there, ladies and gents. I'm excited. Let's do this. Wow, oh, that's cool. This is a deep river dam complex. And I see there's actual still ruins from the other side of the dam on the other side of the river. Wow. This is really, really cool. This was. Oh yeah, so this is kind of similar to like Hales Bar. So these these were the lock systems. And those were those would have been the gates that opened up to allow for various uh, for the water to go through. All filled up now with mud, all kinds of sediment from the river over the years, and now it's growing stuff. And there's the other side. So this was a vital transport lane during the Civil War. And they would use a lot of these dam systems to try to bypass the rapids, control the rapids. This is really neat. Man, I'm excited about this. This is really cool. So there's all kinds of historic places in this area, so we're gonna try to try to find them as many as we can for this video. Oh boy, 
as high. I was like, there's all these like bird nests. These rusted, horrible stairs. So there's all these um, the bird nests, the ones that build like the, like the actual structures oh, wow. underneath. Go see. Almost look like uh, like Are wasps. They I don't think so. Are they? No, that's gotta be. It's too big. All right, let's go up these freaking old stairs. Ooh, I don't like heights. I don't like heights at all. Don't like them. Um, I don't like heights. Did I mention I don't like heights? It's a valid fear. Oh man, there's still more, okay. Uh, boy, okay. Particularly have old, degraded metal. Oh, I just have to be see-through. <sighs> okay, it's all right. You coming up? Oh, there you are. Man, this is, it's cool. I just don't like heights. It's still cool though. Oh. Hi. Hi. Okay. <laughs> you see all the birds? Human beings weren't meant to be way the heck up here. There's still a power line that comes through here. Huh. That's interesting. Whoa, this is cool. You could see why people visit here, take photos. It reminds, this reminds me of the one like in California that Jonah went to with uh, Carlos and Haley. Wow. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah, it's cray cray. That all they have are these little wood platforms. Yeah, I'm not standing on that. I'm definitely not standing on that, but. These would have been housings for the turbines. Pretty show, pretty show, pretty show. Whew. Oh yeah. And these, I think these are similar to like Hales Bar, where these would have been connected to housings and would have supplied electricity. Just kidding. Just kidding. Uh, there's a, a yellow man. Yellowish green man. An alien. Okay, what do we got going on? Somebody was kind enough to put uh, some bug spray up here, some hornet wasp killer. That was nice of them. As well as a towel to wipe yourself down when you're sweaty. Or do, after doing whatever it is you're doing up here. Whoa. Oh, that's, yeah, that's, uh, 
Let's whoa, okay. Yep, definitely hornets. A wasp up here. Man, that's a pretty awesome view though. See, it's it, this, the wiring for power is still coming into the building. Huh. Sadly, there are no more windows. Super cool. I wonder what these are for. These giant blocks. Yeah, see, I think all these birds are nesting in those. Are you up here? Isn't it cool? Right? It's really, really awesome. Oh my God, I'm sitting here. Where do you think I was? I didn't know it was cool in here. Yeah, it's really awesome, right? So these would have been the were the housings for like the big turbines, and there's still actually old wiring, and like there's a power line that still comes into the building, still wired up to the pole across the river. Yeah, and these would have been like in Hales Bar, these um, poles over here, these would have funneled up all of that energy. Oh, where, oh yeah, there's a bunch of them. Somebody, somebody was nice enough to uh, bring some hornet wasp spray. So, this is wild, right? Great place for photography. As well as artwork, I suppose. Yeah. Yeah. There's a Pokemon. Man, this is cool. What do you think? Worth coming to? I uh, guess. Yeah. yeah? It's exciting, right? This is really, really neat. Definitely wish there was still, like, equipment in here, though. But I'm surprised there's still, like, what's here is still here. It's insane. I know. Get some artsy shots here. Right? This is really cool. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it is. Like no? Never seen anything like this? Hey. And try to run uh, Necrophonic up here for funsies. Let's see what happens, right? I'm going to do a little video in for the ticky tacky though, before I do that. Yeah, such a good day. Alright, so, we are going to, I don't know, we're going to play, we're going to play around with the necrophonic in this historic place for fun, see what happens, right? You never really know. You never really know. Does have history. So let's go ahead and go choose the necrophonic. That breeze is real nice. See, I always forget to turn the audio on. There we go. Oh, by the way, get your phone cases because they're awesome. Shameless plug, ujuebrothers.com. <laughs> so, if there's anything here I would like to communicate, 
you can communicate into this device here and I should be able to hear what you're saying is there anyone here who would like to communicate say listen This whole area has a real negative history with people dying in mines as well as the war. Did you die here? How many spirits are with us? Is it eight? Is there anything you want to tell us while we're here? nests. Did someone get hurt here? How did you get hurt? Nothing now. Huh. It's really active for a minute there. I was afraid. Like bird that just flew in. <laughs> yeah. Before we say goodbye, is, is there anything you want to tell us? You want us to leave? Out. You want us to get out? Get out. That's what it sounds like to me. Huh. Uh, it's it like a lot, right? Okay, well, Alright. What's interesting about places like this is because they're so electrically charged, you know? Sometimes you get all kinds of stuff. That's what, like, that's one of the reasons why they say Hales Bar Dam is so haunted. So many people essentially lost their life, and um, and because it's so electrically charged, people get stuck. I, I don't know. No expert, but kind of makes sense, I suppose. If you're as a spirit, you're simply just energy. I don't know. Don't know. But we sounded like to me that they asked us to leave a bunch of times. So we're gonna go ahead and let them be in peace and then try to go find the next really cool thing to add to this right because yeah. we passed some something really cool a really old covered bridge from this area as well as what looked like maybe an old mill or something like an old mill complex Oops. right so just a tin an old mill complex and uh maybe we can find that house i don't know maybe there's some other stuff here i don't know it would be really cool this is really cool though well, there's a trail down there, right? Uh, yeah. Yeah, I think so. But upstream would be that way. Upstream would be that Hmm, I don't know. We're gonna go do some exploring because we're exploring explorers. And uh, see if we can't do some. Hey, get out of here. Freaking. Oh, okay, there's bees everywhere. Yeah, there's bees everywhere. So I'd like not to get stung today. That'd be really cool. And we just forgot to go down the stairs. I know, I know. And uh, as I've mentioned like 10,000 times on this video alone, I do not like heights and this is freaking see-through, which I don't like. Hmm. Anyway, to the next 
location. Let's go.